alone Psych! Hey guys, sorry to trick you, but um, we have a major thing going on in the world right now. 21 Pilots has come out of hiatus. I've been a huge fan for a really long time, which you guys may or may not know. And I just had so much I want to share with you guys and talk about that I, I just had to make a conspiracy video about it. Speaking of conspiracies, for my fan conspiracies, I gotta let you guys know that fan conspiracies are coming to an end. And the reason being is because there's just not enough information to put into a full video anymore because we pretty much covered everything. And even if a couple new things come up, it's not enough to put in a full length video. Hope you guys understand. I will be making a finale, so don't worry about that. Anyway, let's get to what this video is all about. Okay, so we're going to start with where 21 Pilots left off before their hiatus. So they came out with a music video for their song Heavy Dirty Soul, which had been out for a while prior to the music video being made. In the music video, everyone kind of already knew that this video was supposed to represent the death of Blurry Face. Now, if you don't know what Blurry Face is or who that is, you're a little behind and I don't have time to explain. So Heavy Dirty Soul in the music video, Tyler's sitting in a car and it's driving down the highway by itself or by blurry face, whatever, however you want to call it, by a dark entity. And basically the car's falling apart as they're driving and it's supposed to kind of, you know, represent, you know, blurry face is dying. And at the very end, the car basically like blows up or whatever you want to call it. And the beginning of the new music video for the song Jumpsuit, which I love so much, it starts off with blurry on top of the destroyed car. And so I thought it was cool how they tied those videos in together. So I'm thinking maybe they're going to be doing that with the next song. So having all these music videos kind of flow into each other, sort of, so to speak. Now, the main thing about the music video for Jumpsuit that has everybody questioning and fig trying to figure out what's going on is this red caped creature. Now, I'm saying creature because it could be a man, but I'm sure th the way Tyler came up with it, it's supposed to be like a creature of some sort. Maybe blurry face, we don't know. So I did this thing uh, where I googled um, a bunch of stuff until I could figure out who this red caped creature is because it seemed a little biblical to me or kind of like mysterious or like something mythical, you know what I mean? It just kind of felt like that. So I want to do some research, see if there's anything I could tie it to. And I found something. I'm not a very religious person, so I'm not sure how the Bible or any of this works or how you say things, so I apologize in advance. I found this thing from the Bible called Revelation 1911 or 911, whatever you 1911, I think that's what it is. And it's called The Rider on a White Horse. And this is what it says Then I saw heaven opened, and behold, a white horse. The one sitting on it is called Faithful and True, and in righteousness he judges and makes war. His eyes are like a flame of fire, and on his head are many diadems, and he has a name written that no one knows but himself. He is clothed in a robe dipped in red, and the name by which he is called is the Word of God. What? There's a lot going on here. I don't want to like try to decipher this whole thing. You guys probably understand. If you know Bible stuff or you're really religious, maybe you understand this. I don't, but it sounds a lot like the guy in the music video. You know, there's a lot of parallels here. If you want to go look it up, just look up Revelation 19 the little semicolon thing, 11. I'll put probably all the websites where I found all this stuff in the description, so if you want to go check things out yourself or do some research and let me know what you guys think, please do. So obviously we know that there's been a color change in the 21 Pilots realm, as you would say. So everything used to be, you know, red, and now everything is turning into yellow. So I'm kind of interested in that because yellow is a really nice color and I think it represents a lot of stuff. And so speaking of representation, I wanted to Google exactly what yellow represents within, you know, since we're in this Bible realm of things, I wanted to look up what yellow represents in the Bible because maybe it could tie into why they chose yellow and what it's supposed to mean in terms of the music video for Jumpsuit. I basically just Googled what does yellow represent in the Bible and what came up was a thing that said, here the meaning is, yellow is associated with fire, which in turn has always been associated with the purification process. Now, I think that's really interesting because it seems like in this video, Tyler's trying to get away from blurry or try to, you know, pure, excuse me, I just burped. Tyler seems to try be trying to purify himself in a way or try to get away from blurry in a way of purifying who he is, his soul, I don't know. So Tyler, um, before, he used to have like this red ring or band around one of his fingers. It's like his pointer finger or something. I'll probably pull up a picture if I can find it, but he had this red band around his finger. It's now yellow. So 
Um, I thought that was kind of interesting because that also shows that things are changing because the song is really interesting to me because it's, you know, you can tell it's from 21 Pilots, but then there's just something a little different about it, something that kind of seems a little off, but like a good kind of off. Something that kind of makes you question like what is going on and I think that the music video matches that really well and it also like makes it so we can come up with theories and make videos like this. So another thing I was kind of thinking about was jumpsuits in general. Okay, I, I, I understand the jumpsuits for like women are like, you know, full body like um, dresses or like when there's like the dress and pant leg kind of thing. Like those are kind of jumpsuits for women, but then I also know that jumpsuits are also for when you go skydiving. So I looked up what are jumpsuits used for just to see what would come up so it gave the definition of like a jumpsuit for like a garment or like sleeves and legs typical you know covering blah 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 and then it goes into saying um the original skydivers jumpsuits were simple garments designed to insulate the body from the cold of high altitudes and minimize risk of covering important handles and grips i thought that was really interesting and it definitely like kind of sounds like what tyler's going for so it's more of like jumpsuits of like skydiving or like things like of the extreme rather than garments and clothes so also in the jumpsuit music video Tyler, you know, Blurry Face always had the, the charcoal neck and hands or whatever. And when Tyler is following the red coat creature, um, his neck is all like gray and black and charcoal. But then when he turns around and starts running, the charcoal and blackness turn like goes away. So it's like Blurry's there and then he disappears. It seems as if he's fighting it now. And if you read the lyrics and watch the video, he's definitely fighting back now because usually he kind of just gives in which I think is really inspirational and cool. There's also a line in there that says like friend or foe, are they, are they friends, are they nice, are they bad? And I think that kind of represents the people, the, uh, the people on top of the mountains. I think that's kind of like what he's trying to say. Are these people nice or are they against me? I don't really know. Cause at first, like in the music video, when he's looking up at them, he kind of has this expression, ex expression <laughs> words. I'm just talking so fast. I'm so dedicated to this topic. Because he's looking up at these people and he kind of has this expression on his face of are these people nice? Like where am I? Who are they? Can I trust them? I think that's what he was trying to go for with that. And the last thing I wanted to point out about the jumpsuit mu music video is at the very end it goes back to blurry with the broken down car and the flames because the car has been in flames the whole video and the flames just go away and you're left with a broken car and he lifts up the hood and takes out the um coat or the trench coat or whatever and he puts it on and leaves so i'm thinking maybe that's symbolizing that he's gone blurry face is dead because tyler ends up passing out or dying or whatever in the music video so it's kind of like okay is blurry face officially gone now i don't know so a next thing i wanted to point out was from nico and the niners now this i was when i when i first heard the name of this song i was like that's a weird name for a song what does that even like mean and originally i thought is is Josh, Nico, and then the Niners are the rest of the people on the mountains. And then I found out, I probably could have used common sense to figure this out, but I googled it, and Niners are the people who came to California when the gold rush was happening. So it's like all these people have come here for one specific thing. So all the people on the mountains are there for one specific thing, and I think that thing is Tyler. And then when I was looking up Nico, because I'm like, Nico could either be like the guy in the red uh, coat, or it could have been Tyler or Josh up on the hill. But I looked up like Nico meaning, because like, kind of sounds like a Greek name or something and sure enough it was <laughs> and this is what I got origins of the name Nico short form of Nicodemus uh, or Nicodemus I don't know Greek I'm sorry a Greek compound name composed of the elements Nike which means victory and Deimos which means people or population hence victory of the people Maybe I should be like a detective or something. I'm good at this. So yeah, that's basically all the things that I've like found or discovered or wanted to share with you guys because I kind of want to get a conversation going here. I know like this isn't a fan conspiracy video, but 21 Pilots is also close to my heart. And as you could tell, I am pretty much a pretty big fan. So I'm going to leave you guys with some questions that I think it'd be good to think about. Who is the creature in the red coat? Are the rest of the songs in the album going to tell us more when they come out? And what is Josh's role in all of this? Thank you guys for watching. Maybe I'll make another one of these videos if you guys like it enough or if there's other things to talk about when the new songs come out. If you guys are waiting to hear from for the album release, it's October 15th. And if you're going to go see their tour, um, I can put the link to the tour down below so you guys can go and figure that out. But um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you guys next Saturday. Bye!